Has one state in India severely, severely dented the country's fight against the pandemic? The western Indian state of Maharashtra alone has recorded over 52,667 cases. That amounts to over 36% of India's total 145,000 plus cases. Experts say that the cases will only rise in Maharashtra over the next two weeks. But the question is, is the state healthcare system equipped and prepared to treat the surging number of patients? Maharashtra's capital, Mumbai, is fast becoming India's New York. Over 31,972 people are infected in Mumbai. That accounts for 60% of all cases in the state of Maharashtra. The city of Mumbai has more coronavirus patients than any other state in India. India's financial capital accounts for more than a fifth of all cases in the country. Over 1,000 people have died in Mumbai despite India's low fatality rate. Mumbai is fast running out of beds to treat its severely affected patients and the authorities are running against time to construct more hospitals and ICUs to meet the growing influx of patients. A field hospital at the Bandra Kulra complex has been constructed in a fortnight. The hospital has 1,000 beds and 200 ICUs for severe patients. The hospital at the BKC has been prepared in just a fortnight. A COVID care center is being constructed at the Mahala at the Mahalakshmi race course and that hospital will include 600 beds and 125 ICUs while another facility in Goregaon suburb of Mumbai will accommodate 635 coronavirus patients but with Mumbai recording over 1400 cases on Monday alone will this be enough But what's worrying is that the state is failing to protect its first responders and essential service personnel. Not only is the healthcare system overburdened, even the police force is falling victim to this deadly virus in Maharashtra. Over 1,889 police personnel have tested positive in Maharashtra. More police personnel are infected in Maharashtra than the total number of patients in Jammu and Kashmir or even states like Odisha or Haryana. Over 80 police personnel tested positive in Maharashtra in just the last 24 hours. 20 cops in Maharashtra have even lost their lives to the virus. But despite the staggering amount of cases in, in Mumbai, especially, the Maharashtra government has now allowed resumption of domestic flights. Mumbai airport has been directed to handle 50 flights per day, raising the risk of the infection spreading further. As far as the death toll is concerned, over 1,695 people have died in Maharashtra due to COVID-19. One state accounts for 60% of all deaths in India due to the virus. And the state government has more areas of concern than just Mumbai. Cities like Pune and Thane are also registering a sharp spike in cases. Pune recorded 244 fresh cases, taking the virus count to 5,319. Thane registered a spike of 149 cases. There are now 2,739 patients in the district.